Just a second. Hey, it's really you. Hi, yeah, come in. <laughs> Let me hug you. I'm so happy to finally meet up again. It's been, what, three months? Yeah, <laughs> way too long. Uh, so, how have things been going? That's good. <laughs> yeah, I'm also doing fine. Uh, stuff has mostly been the same around here. Well, except for one thing. Uh, come here, I want to show you. <laughs> Ta-da! I got a fish tank. It's really pretty, isn't it? Well, this uh, aquarium is my new pride and joy. I never realized keeping fish could be so much fun. Well, of course, it took a long time to do all the research, uh, get the proper tank, filtration, yada yada. Um, but it was worth it. Uh, so there are three different species in here total. Uh, those big blue fish with the red spots are called a uh, discus and the two smaller species are both types of tetras. Well, the one with the red and blue stripes is called a cardinal tetra and the silver one with the red face is called a remy nose tetra. <laughs> no, not a runny. Rummy. <sighs> I have no idea why they're called that, but who am I to judge? Yeah, all these fish came from South America. Well, these ones specifically were bred in captivity, but their species is from the Amazon River. <laughs> Together they look really pretty, don't they? I'm glad you like them too. Hey, I, um, I didn't want to mention this earlier, but you weren't acting like yourself. What's going on in that head of yours? You seem really out of it. Please, it's not nothing. Well, I've been your friend for how many years now? Exactly. I know when something's up with you. Look, you... You don't have to tell me if you don't want to. But know that I'm your friend. No matter what, I won't judge. Yeah, we can sit on the couch. You know, just... Just relax. And... Take some deep breaths. You can tell me whenever you're ready. I'm all ears. <laughs> well, I agree with you there. It's been a hard few months without you. And I wish I could have kept meeting up, but life was just kicking us both in the rear. Um. You've been feeling lonely? I'm sorry. No, I, I'm serious. Loneliness is a really tough thing, and... And I understand how you feel. It might not 
didn't seem like it, but I was lonely too. That's, um, that's actually one of the reasons I got the fish. I, I wanted another living thing around me that could, um, be interactive, and I figured that fish were pretty, like, low-maintenance. <laughs> I mean, in reality, they require a lot of more work than I thought, but I still love having them around. Sorry, uh, I, I don't want to make this all about me. Um, you know, I just wanted to let you know that I could relate. I, I know I don't seem lonely right now, but that's just because we're finally talking face to face again. And I saw you and that feeling kind of melted away. Oh, hold on. Hold on. What did you just call yourself? <laughs> no, I heard that under your breath. Please tell me. <laughs> Why do you think you're stupid? <laughs> Don't say that. It's okay not to feel the same way as me. Okay, loneliness can stick with you, even when you're surrounded by people. I'm not upset with you for having these feelings. <laughs> of course you can ask for a favor. What do you need? Can I... What? I I'm sorry, you, you mumbled a little bit. <laughs> of course I can cuddle you. That's no problem at all. Like, if I knew that's what you wanted, I would have cuddled you earlier. You look surprised. Why? <laughs> uh, sure, romantic partners can cuddle, but friends can cuddle too. Like, who says they can't? Hey, okay, okay, stop overthinking it. I already said yes. Okay, I promise. It's not weird. Just wait here and let me go grab some stuff, okay? I'll be right back. Okay. So, I braided my bed for soft things. And now we can lay on the couch together. Now just, let me set this, um, pillow up against the armrest, and can you stand up for a second? Thank you. Uh, I am just gonna lay down, and you can lay down on top of me. <laughs> What's the hesitation? Aren't you the one that wanted a cuddle? I already told you, it's perfectly fine for friends to cuddle. There's nothing romantic about it unless we say so. <laughs> okay, um, how about I phrase it this way? It's normal for friends to hug, right? And if you think about it, cuddles are just like a hug, but longer. <laughs> you didn't have to think about it like that, did you? Okay, now come here and snuggle with me. <laughs> That's a spirit, okay? Uh, you can rest your head on my shoulder. And now we can cover ourselves in the blanket and... Perfect. All nice and snug. Are you comfy? Good. Is there anything else I can do for you? 
<laughs> of course I can play with your hair. How does that feel? Well, I'm glad. And now we can simply relax and enjoy this moment together. It's nice to see a smile on your face again. I miss that. <sighs> For the fifteenth time, yes, I'm sure it's okay for us to cuddle. Okay, don't get me wrong, I understand why you were nervous. You know, like, as a society, we place really weird boundaries on touch. Like, like, it's okay for you to hug your friends, but not for too long. Otherwise, it's romantic. Like, you can pat a buddy on the back just fine, but holding hands? That's somehow a couple thing. Like, this stuff is especially weird for guys. Like, for some reason, two girls can be super touchy with each other. And, you know, still be seen as friends. But if two men, or even a man and a woman, just sit too close together, then it's suddenly romantic. But I promise you, okay, those, those social rules are BS. People can hug and cuddle and still be platonic. <laughs> well, we're living proof, aren't we? Exactly. I do want you to know that I'm proud of you. You know, it's great that you were able to speak up even though you were scared. And it makes me happy knowing that I can help my friend feel better. And if you ever want to cut all again in the future, just ask. <laughs> no, it's not clingy or needy. You know, some people just need physical affection to know that they're cared about. And if you're one of those people, then that's okay. I'm more than happy to provide said affection. <sighs> Don't thank me. I'm not doing anything special. I'm just supporting my friend. And while we're at it, I might as well break another social taboo. I love you. You're an amazing friend. And you don't have to say it back if you don't want to. I know it took a lot of courage already to ask about cuddling. But just so you know, you don't have to be shy about saying it. I love you, and I know you love me back. Is there anything you like to do while we cuddle? We can keep talking, or I can pull up videos on my phone, or... <laughs> yeah, we, we can just watch the fish. This sounds nice. I love you too.